Hey guys, this is their review of Star Wars The Clone Wars Ahsoka Tano with Rada the Hutlet. Yeah, that's the accessory. Okay, as you can see, here the figure is molded. Very, very nice mold. And the reason I like this one is because the spacesuit one, she only used once. And as you can see, here's the backpack is what is in the movie. Very nice mold. And a cloth skirt. I like the fact that they're making everything cloth now. You know, that should be cloth is cloth. Anyways, here is the hutlet, which looks like a snot rocket with arms and a face. The arms mm, swivel at the shoulder. That's pretty much the articulation. And the reason I have her on stand here is because with the backpack, with the hutlet, she doesn't balance very well. See? Take her off the stand. Boop. So, anyway, I am... The straps on this thing is adjustable, so you can make it loose, tight, whichever. Anyways, here she is without the backpack. Again, very, 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 very nice figure. And she's got eyelashes. This is the eyelash variant. I don't know if you can see, but this is the eyelash variant. There's the one without eyelashes and then the spacesuit one. I honestly like this one better. Very good molding and paint application. Okay. The head it has a ball joint, swivel waist, ball jointed um, shoulders, and I also noticed that there's no ball joints on the elbows, which I suppose is kind of a good thing because if Hasbro put ball joints on the elbows, then it would break, probably because her arms are so small. Okay, swivel wrists on both of them. And can someone please tell me what this joint is, if it's a hip, or if it's not... So it's like a hinged hip area, a ball-jointed knee, and a ball-jointed ankle. And she even comes with her lightsaber, which is a darker green than most lightsabers. And I also noticed that someone... Some people put her lightsaber like this when she actually carries it like this in the show. Anyway, very, very nice figure. And, uh, I will be doing more reviews soon, as soon as I get newer figures. Or maybe I'll just decide to do one you know, with an old figure I have. So, comment, rate, and subscribe, and I would also like to ask you to leave some suggestions down below in the comments section on what I should do next and what I should do. You know, like, how I should review, or... Yeah, so, this is my review of Star Wars The Clone Wars Soka Tano.